Hello and welcome back here to the channel. We're here on Forza Horizon 5 and Ryan Turk's Toyota hatchback drift car. So we're going to be taking a look at two tr FD tracks that I got tagged in. It's probably some of the best FD tracks to date here in Horizon 5 that I've seen. So we're going to take a look at them. Make sure you follow me on all social media. All that you found in the description box below. Make sure you check in the link down below for all the deals on Close Water. The month is coming to an end. Make sure you get yours before the deal ends. So let's get to it. So we do have some new share codes today, like I said, for some FD tracks that I was tagged in. This is the share code we got, 11482-4936, and it is FD Atlanta. So hopefully we do have solo. So we're going to go up into solo. We're going to go into FD Atlanta in Ryan Turk's car because we're already in it. So we're going to see what this track's all about. So based on the Instagram pictures and everything I saw, it looks amazing. And a little video of that. You know, a few of the people I follow were running. So we're going to take a look at this here for today's episode. As long as one more track as well. A uh, track that one of the tracks I call home in a set of Corsa. We're going to be ripping here in Horizon 5. When we get that gum out. Toyota Corolla of Ryan Turk here. And we're going to Road Atlanta. FD Atlanta. So like I said, based on the video I saw, this is probably one of the best looking Atlanta tracks there is. So we gotta head in there. So it's so amazing that people are tagging me in these, you know, tracks and stuff like that because it's great for me to go in and drive these things. I just gotta find out where I gotta go first. It looks like we just gotta go up here. So I got a bunch of trees and everything up there. We're going up in this part of the track. Oh, oh yeah. Iconic FD Atlanta, Road Atlanta downhill. Let's go full send. Fourth gear hit. So, oh yeah, this does have a very good Atlanta feel right now. Oh, we looped it. Very well done Atlanta track here on this Horizon 5 event lab. Honestly, that feels very much like Road Atlanta. So, we're going to go full set again on it. Kudos to this man. I'll leave his Instagram down in the description box below as well. As well as the share codes for these tracks. One more final run here. Or another run, not a final run. Do a fifth gear hit this time. All the way out to the outer zone. There we go. Oh, a little tire drop there in the dirt. Would have been dirt in actual FD. Oh, we couldn't link that one too well. All these tracks are so much fun. It's so awesome. Like I said in the last episode, to see these kind of tracks here in a set of Corsa and now Horizon 5. So this is amazing. We're going to go another again. We're going to see if we can't get a full pull here in Ryan Turk's car. Well, let's go a little... uh first person action got to stall it out there Man, to link that section though. Oh, just a little drop down there, but managed to keep the car in one piece. These cones leave. Oh, the cones get crushed. Uh, it's the simple things in life. So we're gonna go one final run here in third person. See if we can't get a amazing full pull run, and then we're gonna switch up tracks to another track. One of the tracks I call home 
in a set of Corsa. So let's uh, go full send. Second gear start. That would have been a little bit of a dirt throw there. Oh, we got it this time. There we go. FD Atlanta here in Horizon 5. And uh, we're going to take out these star cones. <laughs> so we're going to check out one more track. So let's get that Jericho going. Probably going to change up cars. Let's go full send. So we're going to quit this event. You know what? We'll keep in Ryan Turk's car. Rather than changing up the car, we're just going to go into the next one. Where I gotta find, I find my phone here. All right, so the next share code. We have two share codes that we're gonna take a look at. So we have two versions of this track. Oh no 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 no! Go back. We have two versions of this track: a day and a night. So we're gonna go check out the day one first. Let's get this share code entered. So this is FD Orlando, and we're going to go full send. We do have a night version of this track as well. Uh, we're going to change up cars. Let's, uh, let's bring out Kyle Mohan's RX-8 full send on this. Let's see what we can do in Kyle Williams RX-8 at FD Orlando. So Orlando and Irwindale are two tracks that I call home in a set of Corsa. And now we're here on Horizon 5 taking on the wall of Orlando. You guys remember we did do Wall, New Jersey. Now we're going to take on Orlando, and we will take on it at night as well because there is a night fair code as well. Ribbit through this bar, okay. Oh, we even got the parking lot? Oh, that's pretty good. We got the parking lot with paddocks for to park the cars and everything. Now we're heading up into Orlando Speed World. Oh, this looks like this would be a good old time. Got the burnout box section. Oh, let's see what we can do here. We've got Echo off the wall. here. Nowhere high enough on the bank where I want to be. Oh, okay. A little bit tricky on this bank. Car definitely not set up for the bank. So we're going to have to give that another go. I think the car may not be correctly set up to run that bank, but we're going to go full send again on it. See if we can't get the car higher up on the bank. Could have been the wrong gear. Oh, okay, yep. Looks like we do need to run third gear here. I just bang off red line. All right, so that's much better in third. So it looks like we gotta run third gear. Uh, RIP headphone users, but it's uh, gonna happen this way. And we gotta check this to look at night, so we're gonna run this one more time here in the day. And we're gonna take a look at the night one. Ah, oh, a little wall tap.
did not get all the way where I wanted to be. This track would definitely take a little practice in order to get this down and dialed. So let's go take a look at the night version before we end this episode off. Definitely fun and definitely need a fine-tuned car for this because of these tracks on the way the banks are and everything. You have to have a really dialed car. Otherwise, it's not going to feel the greatest because of, well, having to build it out of these like wood planks and things like that. So let's go. One final event hub. Go here. I'm going to get that share code out for the nighttime one. Or zero three nine, and this should be FD Orlando nighttime. Let's go solo. We're gonna change cars. So Kyle Malone's car is good, but I think we need to get something with a little more power on the bank. So we're gonna bring out the F22 and see. If that will handle the bank at Orlando in the nighttime. So big thank you to the man tagging me in these and showing me these tracks. Probably some of the best FD tracks I've seen so far here in a set of course. If you guys have other event lab tracks and things you want me to try, let me know down in the comment section down below. Let me know a share code or tag me on Instagram with a share code. We'll check them out. So let's go into... The event lab with the F22. Luckily, you know, there's stadium lights hopefully on the inside. We'll be able to see fully. I'm this way, let's do it. Through this little chute. Probably gonna be another third gear track. And yes. Nighttime here at Orlando Speed World on Horizon 5. Definitely gonna be a fun time, I feel. Full send, probably gonna be a third gear full send, so let's do this. Yeah, it's gonna be a third gear full send. A little bit better in this car than Kyle Moe's car. Get rid of those checkpoint banners on the first run. So now we can get up nice and high on the bank, hopefully on the second run, because we know third gear run. Definitely could be tuning the cars for these, but these are first impressions on, so let's go. I came off because I hit the wall. Oh, they only looped it. So we're going to go into first person mode. And see what we can do in first person for the final run here. Make sure you guys follow me on all social media. All of the description box below. Let's do this. Oh, we came off way soon with that wall hit. I can't see anything. Oh, uh, uh, yep, I couldn't see anything going into that with this driver's net. So, one thing I am noticing, wall hits are not as forgiving as here as it is in the set of course. So kind of pushes you way off track. One final run, can't end on that crappy run. Oh, wall hits, not forgiving. So these are definitely fun tracks. Do need to tune the cars in order to handle these things ultimately perfectly fine. Big thank you to you guys for coming back and watching another episode. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode here on Horizon 5. As always, I thank you guys for coming back and watching. I'm Bill Rabbit. I'll see you guys on the track.